Cannibal tree or Cowrapita guyanensis is a tall, soft wooded tree of the family Lysithidaceae. They earned their name from their spherical woody fruits, which resembles a cannonball. Fruits are produced as a result of cross-pollination between the beautiful flowers that bloom on the tree. The fruit, which grows up to 20 centimeters in diameter, is pulpy on the inside and contains many seeds. A single tree can bear up to 150 fruits, and they usually takes up to a year to mature. The flesh is white colored and turns blue or purple once the shell is cracked, this is due to result of oxidation with air. is pungent and acrid, and the flesh is spongy aqueous or soft. The fruit is edible and normally fed to livestock. It's not usually eaten by people because of its unpleasant smell and sour flavor. Usually a single fruit contains a lot of seeds, ranging from 100 to 400 of them. The seeds normally germinate if sufficient conditions are available, like moist soil or humus present. They should be kept in a shaded area with little sunlight. Cannonball trees thrives in tropical or subtropical climates. They are primarily grown as ornamental varieties in botanical gardens and parks. They have a lot of cultural significance in both India and Sri Lanka, their flowers are used for worship in these places. And it's quite normal to find these trees growing in temples around these places. The extracts of these trees are used to treat a lot of conditions like the common cold, stomach ache, skin conditions, wounds, malaria, and toothache. It can be said that this fabulous and astonishing fruit is what distinguishes this tree from the rest. This amazing physical nature is quite impressive and truly unique. And it has been a wondrous experience studying this tree and presenting its features.